Hello and welcome Zamora Gaming fans. I'm your host Joe Zamora here and we have our week 3 battle versus the Chibi Chews. And of course she brought some scary Pokemon like Skarmory, Primarina. Um, we have answers for the other Pokemon. I mean we have answers for everything but we just got to make sure we're in the right spot. So um, we're obviously leading Yellow Widow here. I'm hoping she leads Skarmory so we can get a good Volt switch out and then uh, bring in Free Me Day. I'm glad to not see the Toxic Croak. Um, I don't believe she brought her Tier 1 Mon, which, you know, it's always nice that we don't have to deal with it. And um, let's see how this goes. I'm hoping to get up webs and rocks. She didn't bring her uh, Raichu, which makes it a little more easy for me. But we'll see how it goes, really, because she could bring something I didn't expect and just swipe my team. So good luck, have fun, XJ9, and let's go ahead and get this battle going. Let's see what she leads with here. Okay, Lego loss. Okay. So she's straight up leading the Situi here. And I'm going to go ahead and just go for the Bolt Switch. Get a little bit of chip. Very defensive. Special. Very specially defensive. So we can go now to Nacho Libre right here. My TV's a little loud. So we get the Intimidate off. So if she goes for the Swords Dance, she's only going to get a plus one. Actually goes for the Porta guys and misses her move. Alright, so let's see what can we do here. We got a free knockoff, so we're just gonna go ahead and go for the knockoff here. If she switches in Primarina, we can always switch out to uh, Swampert. But at least we'll get whatever item she chooses off. Okay, so she's actually gonna go uh, to Drizzle Boy here. And we'll knock off whatever it's holding. Figure that out. Good damage. And it had leftovers. So we can finally... We can go ahead. I don't want to risk being slower. I'm just going to go straight to... Uh, Aqua Fista here. And probably goes for Hydro Pump. Oh, it goes for the Skull. No burn, please. That'd be great. Alright. So, no burn. We get our health back. Now we're free to get up some stealth rocks here. She does have brain up, which is going to boost Primarina pretty well. Let's see what she decides to go to here. She goes to Jet Blue. Alright, so that's her Skarmory. So, perfect. Um, we should be slower than a Skarmory, so I'm just going to go ahead and click Flip Turn. And let's see what JetBlue decides to go for. Stealth Rocks itself, so that's fine. We can deal with that. And since Raichu's not here, we really don't need... Um, we really don't need webs anymore. So let's go back to Yellow Widow. We're going to take the rocks damage, but that's fine. And we're just going to click Bolt Switch again. Pretty safe. Um, you know what? Actually, not safe. Because she can switch to uh, Flygon. So we're going to make that prediction. Switch back out to Aqua Aquafista. Go Flygon. You know you want to. She's thinking about it. 
Because realistically, I should just click Volt Switch here. But I'm going to try to make a play and predict the Flygon Switch. If I do, that's great. If not, I could be in a little bit of trouble. Alright, so obviously I'm faster, so I switch first. Let's see if she switches. Alright, switch made. Flygon comes in. Oh no. She goes to Sidewise. Safe switch. Interesting play. So we're obviously going to have to switch here. Let's go ahead and go to... Man, we're going to have to go to Nacho Deep right here. Very good switch. I was really hoping for the Flygon. But now we got to be wary of the rocks. Rocks is going to be holding our team down a little bit. Intimidate goes off. Let's see. Does she just go Pulse Geist again? Nope. Goes Leaf Blade. Predicted we would stay in. And... Again, we can just get a knockoff off. Alright. Takes out Decidueye. Goes to WB again. Alright. It's only going to go for a Scald. So I'm going to go to free me day and get the defog off because we need, we need these rocks off our side. All right, so let's go ahead and get our defog off. It, uh, he'll probably go, she'll probably go um, ice beam or blizzard or icy wind. But at least we'll get rocks off the field. Yeah, ice beam. And we ain't taking that, so we're going down here. Oh no, we take it. Okay, so let's go ahead and just go for a shadow ball here. Hopefully we take it out. I guess with the rain boost, you should have just went for the scold again. But either way, this is going to be interesting. Let's see if Shadow Ball actually has enough power to knock this thing out. So she stays in. We go ahead and get the Shadow Ball off. Can it KO? And it doesn't. So Ice Beam is going to take us out here. Alright. So is it too early to start sweeping with Sharknado? I don't think so. I'm going to go ahead and pull the trigger here with Sharknado. We still have another sweeper in the back, so it's not too worrisome if we can't get too much done with this thing. But let's go ahead and scale shot here. Get our speed boost. We can't necessarily outrage just yet because Primarina still is here in the back. But at least if it's a Scarf Flygon, we outspeed it now. Alright, so our defense goes up. I mean, goes down and our speed goes up. What does she switch to here? If 
if she goes to Sidui, I'm gonna sword dance in front of it. Okay, this is gonna probably whirlwind me out. So I'm just gonna go ahead and click Outrage. Get some chip damage off on this thing. Rocky Helmet and Roar. Okay. So we get Swampert in. And now she can get rocks up for free. So I'm going to go ahead and get my rocks up as well. Because at least that way we both have chip damage. Ah, oh, Earthquake would have been a great play there, but <laughs> nope. Alright, so we go ahead and get our rocks up at least. And the Skarmory is going to be annoying, but we're going to deal with it. All right, we're going to go ahead and flip turn here. Yeah, pretty safe. Pretty safe to just do that. All right, we flip turn. And we're just going to go Incineroar here. We're not going to play the, the Volt Switch game. We're just going to click Flare Blitz. We should still be able to live an Earthquake from Ligon. Not an Earth Power. So let's just Flare Blitz here. Can't switch out too much anymore. She has to go Flygon this time though, right? Okay, so she goes Primarina. So we're cool with that. We get some real good chip damage off there. She's going to get us knocked out here. We'll just go ahead and click Flare Blitz again on the off chance she switches. Oh, we're faster. Okay. So, this thing's almost gone. It goes for the skull. All right. So we're going to go to Garchomp here. So we go, yeah, let's go to uh, Garchomp here. And we can just click Earthquake and get the kill. She'll probably go Aqua Jet if she has it. I doubt she switches the Flygon straight up. She switched to somebody. Yep, blue. Okay, so Skarmory is going to be her main switch here. Alright, we're going to put some pressure. We're going to go ahead and go for the Swords Dance here. Make Aurora us out, and hopefully we get lucky enough to go straight into, uh... Oh, she went for Roost again. Nice play. I'm just gonna go for Scale Shot, just in case she's trying to switch in Primarina into the Outrage. Alright, one, two, three... Alright, three hits. And we get our speed boost up. And goes for Roost again. Interesting play. I'm gonna go for the Earth. Wait, no, I'm gonna be faster. Alright, we gotta go for the Outrage. This is plus two, should do a lot more. There we go. That's a three shot, but Rocky Helmet's still going to do some damage to us. Iron Head. Rough skin damage, though. Goes off onto him. And we're locked into Outrage, so 
she can pretty much freely roost now. Unless we get a crit. That'd be great. Alright, Rocky Helmet's gonna knock us out of knock us down a peg. We're gonna go down. Um just go outrage again. Knock it out. There we go. We're gonna go down to Rocky Helmet here, but at least Jet Blue's gonna lose a lot of health. But she is wearing my team down. This uh, Skarmory, of course I knew was going to be a problem. Alright, so we're going to go straight to Yellow Widow here. And we're actually going to scout here. I'm obviously just going to click an electric type move here. I'm just going to go Thunder. Let's knock this thing out. If she goes Flygon, that's fine. We'll figure out if it's Scarf. But at this point, yeah, our hand has been forced. <laughs> we got to hit this thing. Okay, so she actually just goes to Decidueye here. So, I'm guessing Flygon is locked choice in some way, shape, or form. Because she doesn't want to switch that in just yet. And this has to be AV, because that was a critical hit. Alright, we're going to go ahead and get some more chip damage off. She'll probably take us out here. Oh, Poltergeist missed again. Oh, wait, no, it didn't. It takes us out. Ooh, critical hit. So, fair. Back back to us. Now, it's time to try to get a sweep going here. Because uh, we need Flick to get some damage off. So, we're just going to go for the crunch. Don't miss, please. We are Hustle Life Orb, so could be a problem, but hopefully it's not. Okay, so she just switches out, so we get a free hit on whatever comes in. Jet Blue, all right. So we get a crunch off. We do get Rocky Helmet damage off on us, but now we're going to max here because obviously she's going to... She's going to go ahead and roost. Oh, three minutes left. Yeah, we got we got a max now. Bring this battle back. I didn't realize I was wasting so much time. That we might lose the timer now. So Skarmory finally goes down. If Flygon Scarf, she goes straight to it. If not, she's wasting she's gonna waste time. But down that thing goes. Let's go Durant, let's get another kill. I don't know if we live in a uh, Scarf Earthquake or Earth Power. Maybe an Earthquake, but certainly not an Earth Power. She's gonna kill this time. Oh no, she went for the move. Sweet. So we're going to find out what Flygon is, special or physical. And we're going to go for the max still spikes. It should knock it out from full. Oh, she's maxing too. Okay, so she might live this hit. We shall see. If she lives this hit, it's GG, because I won't have time to knock out the rest of her mind with uh, Swampert. Uh, 
Ah, dang it. Can we live the next hit? Our defense rose. If it's max, uh, if it's earthquake, we might live it. No, max flare. Yeah, figured. No reason not to bring flamethrower when uh, Durant's on the other side. GG. She might just knock out my Swampert here. I knew it was going to be a thing. But GG's to the Chibi Chews. Taking us down a notch. So we are going to be one and two. We're, we're just going to go ahead and finish this battle out if we can. Just click Ice Punch. I probably doubt we could have came back from this. But, oh well, we'll see. Probably knock this out right here. And it does. So GG to the Chibi Chews. We are now one and two. And I think she's 3-0 now. So, you know, she's having a pretty good season. See you guys next time.